Okay. Uh, question the first. Alex, lightning fast. What is copywriting? Copywriting is getting paid to write words. That, nice. that, that is the, the easiest thing that I could possibly say to answer that question. And it's also the truest thing because no one can agree on what it actually is. Yes. Copy, it really is just printed matter, printed words. Uh, now that we live in a digital age, uh, those are typically digital words. But I, like, I'll give you a few examples. If you ever go to an Amazon product and you see a bunch of words that tell you how cool that product is, that is copy. If you uh, like are searching for a particular brand of hemorrhoid cream and you type hemorrhoid creams into Google uh, and then an ad pops up that says, you know, best hemorrhoid cream, you know, buy now, get one free, something like that. A copywriter probably wrote that PPC ad. In, um, in other words, right, pay to write words. Yeah. Exactly. Uh, that, but, just, yeah. I have like I have this statement from like Wells Fargo Bank that shows me how to like activate my card. You might call that UX copywriting. UX copywriting or user experience copywriting. You literally like if there's a button on a device that a company like for a product that a company makes, well, guess what? You need to be able to verbally and visually describe to someone how to use that button or product or whatever or do things. That's all copy. So what is copywriting? It is what Alex said. They are words that you are paid to write. Sometimes that is content, like things for people to consume. Sometimes that is uh, designed to get people to do a specific thing. I think he and I both specialize in the kind of copy where you are trying to encourage a person to do a specific thing in that moment. But there is nothing wrong with the uh, other kinds of copy, the content kind of copy, because the whole goal of you know any business is paying for that to make you, a prospect, more susceptible to their enticements at a later date. That's the only difference between mm -hmm. like the brand or content side and the actual direct response, like conversion copywriting side. Some people out there uh, will try to draw a line between content writing and copywriting. If I'm being honest, I am one of those people just because in my head, it makes more sense to divide them. However, it doesn't matter what kind of words you're writing as we've just been through, you can still call yourself a copywriter. If you're writing content, you can still call yourself a copywriter. That's fine. But be warned that some people will just say copywriting is only about sales and only about conversions. That doesn't mean it's right to say that because guess what? It's semantics and everyone has different opinions on what should mean what. But just to be very clear, most people in this space will probably divide content writing and copywriting. Very quick breakdown of what that is. Copywriting, we've just been through. Content writing, as Sean started to allude to there, is more about giving value or providing instruction without expecting or measuring a response without trying to convert someone. It's more about giving value, writing nice words, and getting the brand thought of in a better light in the long run. So that's the difference. Blogs, articles, things of that nature tends to come under that content writing umbrella. You are probably going to end up working for a variety of people earlier on in your career. You're going to do a variety of different projects. A lot of them are probably going to be more content based, more mm -hmm. like blog posts, SEO posts, you know, value based posts, emails, things like that, uh, that are designed to engage people. Keep in mind that your goal when you're writing these is uh, how do I say? Not necessarily to write good. Your goal is always if you're working for a client or working for a business to craft your words and craft your writing in such a way as to make the prospect, the future person reading the thing that you're writing, more susceptible to that business's enticements. If you understand how to do that as a content writer, you will always have the ability to get paid as a content writer. Boom. Question one, done. <laughs>